guys in this tutorial you are going to learn how to make change this photo from this to this okay just it's just three steps on doing it the technique is three steps in producing this very image so let's get started I've already imported my image to pixel app so so first of all the image being imported it needs a dark background so you tap on shape to select a triangle it needs a back, dark background and shapes from here so I'll use triangle uh, triangle you turn down the opacity and then you increase the stroke to let's give it five yeah, five is okay to five and then turn this to white then it's white so you tick you rotate it to about seven seven you rotate it to about seven or eight rotate it to about seven or eight let's check let's give it Okay, to about 64. Just make it 64. So it's going to look like this. It's going to look like this. You expand it a little. So the main thing will just place it at the middle for this very time. Place it at the middle and then just place it at the middle. at the middle so I tick and then next thing is to go to the shadow yet yeah, the shadow enable it and then well we'll pick let's pick pink first pink Let's pick pink. Alright. Looking for pink. Pink, 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 pink. Oh, sorry, purple. Let's, uh, let's use purple. Let's use purple. So you increase this, increase this, and okay, you increase this, and you copy the code, copy this, because the code is very important, we'll use it later. Then press OK. Press OK. Create a copy of the triangle. So we we'll just create a copy of the triangle again. Again. And then set it at the center. This is the second one. And then. Okay. Go to shadow and you increase the blue radius to six to 15. Let's go with 15. Okay, you tick and then you copy again. Just need to duplicate, copy, then you take it at the center again at the center. 
and then increase the radius to 20 now all right you see mark you duplicate again you copy you bring at the center at the center all right and then you increase to the shadow and then you increase it to 25 this time you make it to 25 25 so what you have to do now is to select everything okay you need to match the three triangle oh, sorry they want to you need to match all the triangles together they are four so you match them together okay now they are all meshed together you can see this they are meshed together move it to the towards the head So now you move to max and then enable it then you reduce the size okay I need to reduce my size I reduce it you can see that anywhere the distance is oh, sorry you just need to move it you reduce the size okay I'll go with this first then to move it I need to put it here Okay, so I take it up. Take it up. You see the very place is touching the no light. So I need to reduce this. I need the light to reflect here and then stop towards the head. Towards the head. Okay. seems it's somehow too much let me see you just need to take it in a little to leave it like this okay you need to adjust it so that it will look nice you understand so i need to also give it cap at the hand you draw just draw the distance close you understand so you see what you are doing so try it close and then let's see this okay this is the head it's a gap from it let me see that's perfect so I need to also make the hands so I need to add add it just need to add it Need to add this. I need to add this. I don't know why this is not moving. Okay, I've added it. So I take, reduce it. I need to reduce it to the hand level. You see this? I mark this so. I move it. Okay. Sir. 
so I'll just move it move it a place here so we need to draw it close you draw it close so you see everything well what you are doing it's a very simple stuff so you can now see it place here and then draw it in draw in draw in yeah. you see that so I take this down and I move it let me see yeah so I should work on this one yet It's how it's to be. So I take it in. See if the hands are not too okay here. All right, let me work on this. And so on this. Yeah, better like this. So you take it in. Now looking perfect. It's okay now. So what I have to do? How to make it illuminate with glowing effect? You just select the image, the background, and it's done. You can see I've selected the background, the one I said I imported, and then I turn on, I enable this. So. You select gradient field and then you add then add a top color the top color and the top color Oops. No. sorry you select on the background you enable it then from here paste the code you copy yeah the code I said we copy you press it here you press it here and you press next so just mark tap change press ok Reduce the opacity to about 30. You reduce it about here. I'm still going to check on it. You reduce it about here for the bottom color. You still do the same. You go to the right up, you mark this, and you replace it with the one we copied. Yeah, and you press now, pressing next will take you to the to this bare one. So you just click and then it have change so you press ok and then you reduce this reduce the about 10 percent you reduce it about here around here then you take this here somewhere here yeah you take this somewhere here I still check on this I should check
color filter and then you reduce the saturation about 7 70 minus 70 yeah minus 70 oops minus 70 yeah minus 70 you reduce it about 70 now you now merge the image you merge the image with the merge the boot okay and now go to color filter color filter and increase the saturation to 10 the brightness the saturation to 10 saturation to 10 saturation to 10 Ash. Then decrease the brightness to about minus 10. Brightness to minus 10. Okay. And also increase the contrast to around 10. I'm oh, sorry. Around 10. 10. So now you see we are almost done now you can play with this to any color you feel like giving it you can play with that because you're done that's it for this tutorial i hope you find it interesting please like our video and if you need more stuff like this you can easily subscribe nothing big there well, you can see the beauty now. Yeah, here it goes. Alright, let me save this. Let me save, sir. Let me save this. That's all for today. Please subscribe and like the video. And if you have any comments, thank you.